Hello YouTube and welcome to another video with Bluetooth here and I will be doing a root video, correct? This will be a very specific video because <laughs> I had to figure out a lot of this by myself because a lot of douchebags wouldn't help me. So <clears throat> I will be helping you with your personal problems. It just does it in the comments. So what you wanna do is you wanna have modo fail, which is only for some let's see. It's only for these devices. You could try it on the other devices, but it probably won't work. But <clears throat> what you want to do is you want to have the latest devices, um, drivers installed for your device. Correct? I know a lot of people are telling you that, but you want to make sure you have them installed. And then you want to have USB debugging on, which you're probably like, I do. It's not regular. Yes. I know, I've been having the same problem, but what you want to do, I'm sorry for the background noise, but, um, what you want to do is, you back up all, this is the easiest thing to do, open, let's see, you want to plug your, it has to be the cord that came with your device, so what you want to do is you want to plug it in, open, and then you just, um, you want to take, all these files drag them off into a file and then and then you reset your whole phone yep and then these ones too you reset your whole phone i know i sound very crazy right now but you reset your whole phone see there all your files on, are in this folder that would be right here that is very it is very simple it is and then after you're done rooting plug it back in drag the file back in there not that hard and that's how you get it. Um, and if and if you open Moto Fail regular and <laughs> you run it with no errors, it may not work. So you want to get the fix package. I will have the link for both in the description. So after you have all that done, don't worry about any of this. No, just click run dot bat, and you just see if you look at it. Yeah, that's pretty much what I told you. It'll say, waiting for device. It should say device found, or it means you don't have packages and stuff. And then if nothing, and then if you didn't reset your phone, it will say, motor fail package not found, because it failed to install the package because access is denied. So, yeah. And then it should say success. It'll exploit. It'll go through. I I'm totally just explaining the whole process here, because I, I am very good with coding, not to brag or anything. And it installs this package that right here it installs the this one and then these are the these are the this is the thing it gets at the end it installs these in the package which are applications don't delete those if you find them up on your phone so then I'm gonna file a bug report and the vibration should be different like you it it says right there how to do it it's not that hard and you just click continue, it'll root. It really doesn't take a minute, it takes like a few seconds. It'll say cleaning up, and it'll say success. If it doesn't say success, it says failure, you, f you freaking suck. I'm just kidding. You did, you did something wrong, and there was an error that you didn't pay attention to. You've got to make sure everything is good and go. It has to say success here and here, or it will not work. And I'm not going to continue and reboot my phone, because I already have root, and I really don't want to try risking and screwing it my phone up again and once again i'm very sorry for the background noise so happy rooting and i hope this works out for you if you have personal problems message me and i'll tell you how to fix it so have a beautiful weekend and goodbye